Woohoo, woohoo, it's a pizza party today. It's a pizza party today. Pizza, 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 pizza party. Whoa. It's not pizza time, it's Christmas time. It's Christmas time for a pizza. See these pizzas? Uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Yep. These are, we're, we're doing an unboxing today for the With teenage, my Santa hat. With your Santa hat. Let me get you into focus. <laughs> uh, IDW Games Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Stretch Goals for the City Fall uh, um, Kickstarter. Yes, that's what it is. The Kickstarter way back in the day, prior to Batman the Animated Series Kickstarter. <laughs> anyway... We'll uh, unbox, show off the minis up close so you can check it out. I'm Ellie Funt. That's Miss Rocks. Okay, I'm getting out of the way. Okay, so first up, we have, we have dials. Are the dials? These came separate. But there's three sheets of them. Yeah, looks like uh, well. At least two sheets. Very thick. I'm, I'm thinking two sheets. No, there's three. There's three? I can't tell. They're so thick. Well, maybe you can open it up quickly. Yeah, there's three. Okay. Well, let's have a look what's on the other side. There we go. So they know it all petered out. There. Ugh. Okay, rotten pizza dials. Probably for the bad guys, I'm not sure. And good pizza. And stretch box down. Stretch box, the stretch goals down. And it also comes with dials. Okay, well, we'll, we'll quickly put this in front. Put the white piece of paper. Let's swap it around. Yep. So it's we have no. the only card that has no figure. Okay, yes, this card does not have a figure in this box. The figure you can use is the Lona Raff figure, which is in its own box, which was a Kickstarter exclusive. So there's a we video of it. Box. Yep. There's a, a video of it elsewhere on the channel. Okay, so we'll get the first miniature now. Pigeon Pete. Pigeon Pete, you say? Everyone's favourite. I want to see whoever doesn't like How's Pigeon that? Pete. Pigeon Pete, so sexy. <laughs> now the question is, are we talking about the miniature here? Or the game designer who helped produce TMNT? He's hanging out on Facebook, chatting to people, and helping out with rules questions every now and then. He's cool. Anyway, so that's Pigeon Pete. There's his card. We'll use Pigeon Pete as a size comparison. Wow. This one's huge. Koya. This one has three cards. Foot Clan leader. Three cards? Mm -hmm. You're right. Anyway, we'll show you a size comparison in just a second. So there's the first card. There's the second card. And the third card. So, uh, yeah, all slightly different. I'll just put Pigeon Pete just in front. There we go. Oh, whoops, Pigeon Pete flew the coop. <laughs> Pigeon Pete down. <laughs> Who's next? Mouses. Okay, this, this is just ridiculous. <laughs> this. Try and guess how many mouses are there. A whole bundle. <laughs> So how many mouse, flying mouses are there? Fifteen. Fifteen, okay. So we're not going to... There's way more figures than every other pile of figures. Yep, 
kind of looks like a a drum with cymbals. It kind of looks like it's serving pizza. <laughs> yeah, it could be a mouser serving pizza. Uber, <laughs> eat your heart out. Uber, food delivery people type. It comes with two cards. Yeah, there are no, two cards. We'll just quickly move all these flying mouses <laughs> out of the way. That becomes a wrap. So these are just single sided. Yep. Okay. Don't forget Pigeon Pete comparison. I'll do the uh, comparison in just a second. So there you go. That's single sided. I'll just get Pigeon Pete next to the flying mouser so there we go Pigeon Pete's got to be in all the shots at some point there's the other mouser now who have we got here? Alopax Alopax Alopex Candy canes good. Yeah. Candy. You've got a thing for candy canes. It's Christmas. Uh, people up north in the northern hemisphere, it's cold. Down here you're wearing a fluffy hat and we're in Australia where it's not cold. Hot. Anyway, there's the card. I will just move these out of the way slightly and put Pigeon Pete down. Pigeon Pete was bigger. Pigeon Pete's a hefty sod. Anyway, that gives you an idea of that. Now, next up, who have we got next? Metalhead! Danny's invention. Danny's invention of Metalhead, the new turtle. There we go. Who was good, turned evil, then went back to good to, to save the turtles risked his life and died. That's kind of sad. Mm -hmm. Anyway, that's Metalhead for you. He's got a Terminator mode, apparently. And throwing in Pigeon Pete for a size comparison. Pigeon Pete! <laughs> Somehow I don't think these are to scale, otherwise Pigeon Pete is humongous. Okay. Who's now? Oh, whoa, wow. <laughs> well, Leatherhead! Leatherhead. He uh, looks quite hungry. I think he'd be fun to paint. <laughs> All the scales on him. Uh, and that's a smile only a mother could love. There's the uh, the card. Now I can't help but feel this is more in scale. Pigeon Pete next to Leatherhead. Yeah, it would be more in scale. There we go. Okay, so after Leatherhead, Victor. Who, Victor. Victor. I feel like Pete's going to be almost as tall as Victor. Victor Savante. Savant? Savante. Savat. Savat. There's no N. Don't know why I added that in. Um. Victor Savat. The Savat leader. Oh, there's a couple of cards for Victor. Victor the French Assassin. And the second, whoops. Victor down. Okay, so that's that. Go in for a little bit of a size comparison. go. We've got someone else coming up. You got someone else? A whole bunch of them. A whole bunch you say. Okay, there's a whole bunch. One's already fallen down. Quick look. 
There they are. Who are these? The Savat Ninja. Actually, I'll do size comparison after I move all these guys off. That's the first card. And there's the second. And for a quick size comparison. So who's next? The Stranger. Move Pigeon Pete out of the way. The Stranger. Mm -hmm. Okay. There he is, rotating about. His card is coming up. Two shakes of a bunny rabbit's tail. Or it would be if uh, Usagi was here. There's the stranger. This is going to be a lot of fun putting these, putting these back in their original spots. Yeah, that's definitely going to be a, an is interesting pastime. Oh, what have we got here? Is this old uh, scratch? An unaffiliated leader. A crafty crook cat. Okay, so... There's the card. A very quick... size comparison. And now, next up... Okay, we got uh, a trio here. Foot assassins, are they? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'll quickly put them there. Well, it there. We've got two two cards for the foot assassin. long scary fingers. There's card one and card two. And Pigeon Pete butting in to say how awesome he is. Actually he's probably saying how awesome the game is and hoping you agree. Whoops. We really need to get an editor. Mm -hmm. The Rat King. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Ba -ba. It's a whole bunch of rats at his feet. It's kind of cool. I'm just picking out the ones that I want to show. Yep. A little bit of a size comparison. Pigeon Pete coming around for a look. There we go. Now this, the next batch. Flying things. A whole bunch of flyborgs. the flyborgs. Well, a flyborg. Well, a whole bunch of them ran away because they didn't want to be captured. There's the first card. And the second card. You still need to do a size comparison. 
which is right here. One size comparison coming up. Okay, so after the flyborgs, we have Baxter Stockman. Everyone's favourite lunatic. One science mad up. Who turned into that into a fly? Oh, there's the uh, card. And coming around now for quick size comparison. Is this the last one? Yes. Worm. Worm! The one that caused so much trouble in the Flaming Turtles lost their home. And Casey Jones. Casey Jones wished for something cool to happen. Zombies appeared and then found this cool box. Well, this is the last mini. And that does not yet quite conclude. Because beyond the minis... And the cards. A few other odd bits. So also in this box comes a whole bunch of scenarios to play. So there's definitely a lot of gameplay that you can do. Even comes with an idea of how where to put stuff. A uh, packet of map tiles, two double sided ones. Uh, this one, I'll go through every single one of them. Packs of cards, some player boards, and dice. Dice. Not dice scissors, because that's not a real word. Yep. Uh, anything else? No. Just some plastic bags. I hope you enjoy. Like and subscribe and hit the notification bell. And also, watch show the elf. Can't show the elf.